Uh, hello, uh, today's topic is uh, H. pylori infection or Helicobacter pylori infection, you know. Now, Helicobacter pylori uh, is a bacterium uh, that causes the chronic inflammation in the stomach and the duodenum and is the common contagious cause of the ulcers worldwide. Now, these bacteria are sometimes termed as uh, ulcer bacteria. Now, the H. pylori causes uh, chronic inflammation, uh, which is known as a gastritis, by invading the lining of the stomach and producing a toxin termed as uh, uh, vacuolating cytotoxin A, or uh, also known as VAC, VAC. And uh, the, uh, it can lead to the ulcer formation. Now, although uh, many infected individuals have no symptoms and other infectors may have like uh, belching, you know, or bloating, or nausea, vomiting, you know, or the abdominal pain or abdominal discomfort. And the more serious infections uh, uh, cause the symptoms like abdominal pain, nausea, vomiting, or the blood vomiting, you know, or the fatigue, you know, or the dark pass of uh, the stools, you know. Uh, and uh, low red blood cell count, decreased appetite, diarrhea, heartburn, and bad breath. Now, H. pylori is a contagious, however, some individuals may be simply have the bacteria in their gut, you know, and the bacteria causes no symptoms of the disease. Uh, diagnosis uh, of the H. pylori infection includes the tests of the antibodies in the blood and the uh, uh, urea breath test and the endoscopic biopsies as well. Now, the chronic infection of the H. pylori weakens the natural defense of the stomach. So, most individuals with the symptoms need to be treated to prevent ulceration formation. And uh, it can be difficult to uh, eradicate from the stomach with the antibiotics because the antibiotics resistance. Consequently, two or more antibiotics or the heavy dose of the antibiotics are required. And uh, these are difficult to treat, you know, in fact. In general, the patients should be treated if they are infected with the H. pylori and have the ulcers. And the patients who develop the MALT lymphoma, which is a type of the cancer, you know, of the stomach, have the lymphoma progress if the H. pylori is not treated and eradicated. So in that case, you need to be very careful and you need proper treatment. Uh, Thank you very much for watching this video. If you need more information, you can visit our website www.diseasesandtreatment.com. Thank you. Everybody.